We were 9 p.m. on February the 1st and Tilly has been panting like this for about three hours now. She hasn't stopped. And I think she's ready for her babies to come out. Oh, licking a bum. So I think we're in for a long night. We're gonna sit with it this evening. Good girl, Tilly. Hey, my drinking off mama mama is being amazing she's been outside for a wee and a poo and that one has just drank that much milk she sent herself to sleep <laughs> look at that she's so content now good morning from one day old bumblebee and mommy matilda she's gone for this so it's the next day and I thought I'd just explain why Tilly only has one baby. So um, she went into labour on her due date, day 63, and she gave birth to one massive puppy. She was um, 432 grams, which is almost a hundred, well over 100 grams bigger than our biggest puppy we've ever had. Um, she struggled delivering her, and but she did it on her own, uh, naturally. And because we saw the scan and saw that there was three puppies, we were expecting two more to come out. She panted for a very, very long time. Ended up taking her to the vets to get her checked over and she had some um, injections to induce contractions because the vet could still feel something in her tummy. Um, long story short, um, she ended up then having an x-ray and there was no more puppies. So it means she'd probably reabsorbed the two that were on the scan. And she just had the one baby and the reason she got so big is because she had all the room in the womb to get as big as she wanted. So that's the situation. So we have one beautiful baby girl and her name is Bumblebee at the moment. She is a chocolate roan and tan and yeah we are so happy with her, she's so healthy. We're so proud of Tilly and her baby girl and I will still be documenting everything. It'll just be one baby instead of three. I've just, got, I've just had a shower because I did the night shift last night with um, Tilly and baby and Tilly's feeding her at the moment. Um, she's already put weight on already um, in the first 24 hours so I think she's going to be a big girl. Um, there's a few things we need to learn with having a singleton puppy. Um, at the moment I'll show you. So if you can see bumblebees feeding on Matilda but then we've got some toys here that look like puppies. So this is so that she learns how to climb over siblings even though she hasn't got any. Um, hello Dilly, is that your baby? So she learns how to use her legs and stuff like that. So they're on there at the moment and last night I filmed her and she was climbing over them all. So she thinks they're her siblings. Hello Dilly. And today we're going to get her a heartbeat teddy so that she thinks she's got someone else in there with her. So she doesn't feel lonely. At the minute she's got mummy in there with her so she's quite happy. And she's happy to have the whole milk bar to herself. Isn't she beautiful?
morning baby is three days old today Matilda's looking beautiful as ever and look how fast baby is let's see if I can get her to oh she's gone underneath mama look how fast she is so this is bumblebee and she's so cute look at her go not weighed yet today, but yesterday she put on 100 grams since birth, so she is one chunky puppy. So I'll get the scales ready, and I'll get the baby. Good girl. 6.65. Oh my goodness. You chunky girl. So Bumblebee is four days old today. Good mummy. She's looking after her, feeding her up. She has the milk bar to herself, obviously, so it's not hard to get her chunky she's already like almost on her way to doubling her weight which for reference bear from our first litter our boo bear he didn't double his weight till day 13 so or 14 even um so this one is only four days old and she's nearly doubled her weight here she is here's little bumblebee she's so beautiful her little face and she's got symmetrical eyes she's got all the markings on her back Mama. and she's 666 grams now hello my beauty queen 